hello friends in this video we are going to create the config table products so let's start with it okay so go to the dashboard go to the catalog products catalog products config table product So I'm making the product name configurable. Sorry. Okay, this is the SKU. I have set the price should be zero. Okay. Quantity should not be because we have to create the this Porsche like the simple products we have to add over it. Category you can define test. Okay, now let's create the con configurations. I don't think so. We have any attribute over here. So let's check. We have two merchant center category. Let's make first of all what we have the products let's make some color over here products add the color so that we can fill uh, we can make the configurable products on the behalf of it we have three products let's make it the color attribute if it has Is there any color attribute no there is no color attribute so go to the stores attribute set there is default let's check if it is a color then why it's not showing we have color let's drop it save this attribute Let's check whether the color attribute is coming to this product or not. We load this product what we have on the behalf of the attributes we have to create the configurable products if the attributes are not there in the simple products then we are unable to create the configurable products color is there but there is no nothing in this field so let's go to the stores product we have color So here we need to add the colors, add option, if I want to add white, Let's copy this and paste this, white, red, green,
okay make it default option and what are the attributes options here global unique yes add options filters yes drop down yes values required save attribute the attribute is saved let's check it is coming in the products or not let's reload this products let's yes the cache we need to flush the cache let's flush it let's see this coming so let's save this product with white Now the product is loaded. Let's make it uh, red. and make it the last one to be green okay now we have assigned attributes to the simple products now let's move to our configurable products this is the configurable let me save this product so that we can edit later on we have saved these products by default it's why it's nothing it required let's move to the in stock and let's add the configurations which we have the attributes we have to select the attributes color next all this one next next generate it will generate three products okay let's remove remove this one remove this one we have to add products manually because this product this is not visible first first one we have to add this all products when we remove the la this one this product green then it will come over here remove this product add products manually this is the last product that we are required done we have add three products save this one flush the cache
it's done now let's check the front end we have this test one let's see our configurable product is visible or not our configurable product is there let's see all the all these three products are visible in this field or not see the configurable product whether you want to choose which size color white then red so red image so for green it will show the green image okay so this way we have to create the configurable products in magento 2 if you have any query any doubt you can comment in the comment box and we will resolve your query thank you for watching this video have a great day